What's up everyone, welcome back to my top 10 setups of the day series. Before we get started, make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel to see more of these amazing setups. For the first setup on our list, we're starting off with a simple and yet cute and coordinated build from Imani 19. Whilst OP does have a decently large IKEA Calbi desk, they help maximise their desk space by putting that AOC monitor up on a riser, giving them plenty of room under the monitor for storage. Over to the left hand side of the monitor, we can also see the Mac Mini that's powering this setup, as well as one of the two Logitech speakers that not only provides sound, but it's also aesthetically matching the setup. Last but not least, instead of a mouse, you can see that OP is using an Apple Magic trackpad. Up next we've got this super cosy inspired setup from the user named Nutty Ducky YT. The thing that really brings this setup together is that adorable wallpaper whilst it's been displayed on a 20 inch Scepter monitor. We can see the OP's peripherals surrounding the monitor which include a variety of Razer products such as the Razer headset stand and the instantly recognisable Razer Def Adder mouse in white. When paired with the cool blue ambient lighting in this room this build gets a really nice ethereal glow that turns it into an inviting and comforting place. Up next is a setup from Amada's Rise, who's created this stunning blue and orange build, whilst also utilising a minimalist design. Starting off, we've got this gorgeous single monitor display in the form of an Alienware AW3418DW monitor on an Ergotron LX monitor arm. Below the monitor, we've got a pair of very fun keyboards, with the white one featuring MT3, BIIP 2049 keycaps and the blue keyboard currently in use is utilising GMK Striker R1 blue keycaps. Beneath that blue keyboard you can also spot a matching cause desk mat that helps complement both the keyboard and the monitor whilst contrasting the desk. Flanking the monitor we can spot a set of Edifier Luna HD2 speakers that add some interesting shape to the whole build and help make it stand out. At our number 7 spot we've got a build from the user named Content Homework 6260 who's got the definition of a cosy workspace. Starting off with their displays we're looking at a dual monitor setup utilising two large and impressive LG monitors. On the desk we can spot the instantly recognisable glorious Model O mouse as well as what looks like a black NZXT PC case. Similar to the last setup I love the colour scheme here which uses blue and orange both of which are complementary colours that work really well to make the whole setup pop. Up next we've got this amazing music production setup from Camille Kiri. First off, those super interesting panels lining the walls and ceilings of the room, which are known as the acoustic ab fuses. On the wall you can see a mounted LCD display, which is a 34 inch II Yama GB3466WQSU B1 display. Down below this on the desk you can spot a pair of HS7 speakers on some Millennium DM1 speaker stands. However if you want your sound to be a little bit more personal, the OP also has a pair of Beodynamic DT990 Pro headphones. The rest of their peripherals include a Logitech mouse and what looks to be a Razer keyboard. Last but not least is their impressive PC which includes an AMD Ryzen 9 5900X, an Asus TUF Gaming X570 Plus, and a Gigabyte GTX 1080. Our next setup comes to us from Manicio, and it's a definition of cute, adorable and cosy. Starting with their peripherals, we've got a fantastic, glorious Model O mouse next to a Ducky 1-2 TKL keyboard with some Animal Crossing themed PBT Islander keycaps. Both of these are sitting on a super cute Duggy Wonderland desk mat. Now looking at their displays, we can see an MSI Optics Mag 24C monitor on the right and an Acer monitor on the left. Here at our number 4 spot we've got this very chill neon setup from Zamina. This setup features a dual monitor setup that utilises an Asus monitor on the bottom. On the desk you can also spot the classic glorious Model O mouse, as well as a Lian Lee PC-011 dynamic PC case in the extra large size. Finish off the vibe of the build, they're also using some sweet nano leaf lights as well as LEDs to backlight the desk and the monitor. And even a Govi light on the far left. This setup seems like an amazing place to relax and lose yourself in with some late night gaming. Next on our list is this super well put together and very coordinated build from the original Dark. Starting with their displays, we've got a triple monitor setup with the main monitor being a Viotech GFT27DB monitor and the two vertical monitors being LG24MK600M monitors. 
The left and the main monitors are mounted with a Vivo dual LCD monitor desk mount and the right monitor is utilizing an ER Gear monitor mount. Down on the desk we can see a drop alt 65% keyboard with halo true switches and drop 9009 keycaps, a Pornage Ultra mouse and Creative Pebble V2 speakers. In that PC on the right you'll find a Ryzen 5 5600X CPU, a Gigabyte RTX 3070 GPU, all tucked inside a Corsair 275R airflow case. Up next we've got this super clean and sleek build from Timbo Slice. This build features a Keychron K3 V2 keyboard with round switches, a Logitech mouse, an Omen monitor on a Wiley single monitor arm, a ThinkPad laptop on a BT Magic laptop stand, and a Staples Hiken mesh chair. To bring this whole setup together we've got this amazing lighting courtesy of some Nano Leaf canvas lights. The last setup on our list comes from the user WEP1983. This amazing setup manages to completely fit inside a closet while still looking this stunning. In this setup you can find an LG38 GN950 monitor, an Acer monitor, a Varmilla Mia Pro Summit keyboard with black ink switches, a Logitech mouse and a Varmilla mousepad. This unbelievable setup really goes to show that you don't need a huge room in order to make a killer setup. And that is the end of the video. If you have enjoyed it, please leave a like and comment down below which setup was your favorite. If you're new around here and you wanna see some more, subscribe to never miss one of my next videos. And I'll see you all in the next one.